everybody, and I want to welcome everyone to this episode of The Booze Geek. My name is Chuck, and I am your host. And before I get started, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. And if you like the episode, hit that like button too. Give us a big thumbs up. And I'm going to thank you all in advance. But on this episode, we are tasting and reviewing a beer from Three Floyds Brewing, and they are located in Munster, Indiana. So let me grab the can out of the beer fridge. Because the beer we're tasting, well, this is their flagship beer. This beer is available year round. This beer is the one, the only, the zombie dust. The zombie dust. And that's actually perfect because Halloween is right around the corner. Hmm? So, perfect timing. So, what is this beer? Well, this beer is an undead IPA. This beer clocks in at 6.5% ABV, and it's got an IBU of 62. Uh, yeah, so uh, with all that, let's uh, wake the undead. Let's crack this uh, zombie open. Here we go. I'm getting silly over here. Anyways, enough of that. Here we go. One, two. Boom, boom. Actually, I'm acting like a zombie. It was kind of fun. No smoke. No smoke. But let's get a nice pour here. Oops. We're dripping, but that's okay. That's okay. We'll clean it up later. That should do it. Yeah, that should do it. Ooh, yeah, we made a mess here. Eh, rub that into the tablecloth. No one will know. <laughs> the zombie dust. It's because we're zombies over here. But look what we got color wise. Ooh. That is a nice orange with a darker orange in the middle and we got two finger veil of uh, yeah just under two finger veil of very nice carbonation and foam on top absolutely but uh, let's give this one a swirl I'm gonna get this one to open up and let's give this one a nose because this is it this it, it, it says it's not normal it's zombies it's not normal here we go oops here we go. Let's get this a nose. Let's get this a nose. Here, nose. Nose number one. We're nosing it, baby. We're nosing it. Nose number one. Here we go. It's not normal. Ooh. Well, right off the bat, <gasps> juicy citrus. We are getting a little bit of orange, a little bit of pineapple. There is also some slight pine. And one more quick nose. Slight bitter grapefruit pith. Hmm. Yeah, it's got a nice nose. I mean, it is a big, juicy, citrusy aroma coming through. But like I said, just that hint of date. Ooh, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I lost it again. The wind's picking up. I lost it. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. The zombie, that's what had. The zombies are pushing it over. But anyways, uh, let's give this one one more swirl. And uh, let's give this one a sippity sip. Here we go. So let's prose to three Floyds and prose to the zombies. Here we go. Prose, baby. Sip number one. It's not normal. Whoa. Wow. Okay. I'm going to take another sip. I'm going to say this is a medium-bodied beer, but it's it's teetering between light-bodied and medium-bodied, absolutely. But what do we have flavor-wise? I mean, and I'm going to also say this is really, really easy drinking. Oh, yeah. But flavor, we have... Mm, Citrus, a little bit of pineapples coming through. We have a little bit of orange zest. We're also getting a little bit of lemon zest. I mean, it's it's juicy. This is a juicy undead IPA. This is juicy. We're also getting. Say, I'm gonna say a little bit of lime zest as well. I mean, it's it's juicy, baby. It's not normal. Uh, I'm gonna give it one more sip. Why not? It's juicy. Mm. And, and just you know, on the back end, 
little bit of pine, very, very slight pine, but it's also getting like um, a little bit more of that little bit of grapefruit pith, a little bit of bitterness, like a little bitter grapefruit pith. I mean, this beer is exceptional. I mean, this is a very, very good beer. This is very well done. It's 6.5. It's easy drinking. I mean, this is a really easy drinking IPA. Oh, excuse me, undead IPA. What would I give this on the pint meter? Mm-hmm. Ooh, the zombies are coming. It's splashing out. I think this one may be cursed with the zombies. Uh, I'm going to give this beer... I'm giving this beer a 9.5. I mean, this is, this is a really well done beer. I'm not... No, all joking aside, this is a very, very well done beer. It's a juicy IPA. I mean, it is very easy drinking. It's not immediate. It's, it, it's teetering between light, medium body, but it's just the aromas are there, the flavors are there, and yeah, I mean, it's just well. I mean, it's just rounded out really well, and uh, so well. I'm going to take one more quick sip. And I recommend everyone go out and either buy a tall boy or a six pack or maybe a 12 pack. And with that, I don't know what just fell, but I want to thank everyone for tuning into this episode. And as always, you can follow me at the websites, which are www.pubsapplepainton.com or the blog, which is www.pubsapplepainton.blogspot.com. And uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next episode. So raise that pint. See you next time. Cheers. Prost. And enjoy.